Good morning and welcome back. We are jump starting your morning at the 11th annual Beverly Art Walk. It's an event full of art, live music and so much more. Our Marissa Perlman has a preview of tomorrow's big event from the Beverly neighborhood. Good morning, Marissa. Good morning to both of you. It's been an amazing morning already here, really celebrating all that Beverly is about. I'm here with Sal Campbell. She's kind of the brains behind the operation, co-founder of The Walk. Thank you for being with us bright and early. Thank you so much for having me. So much to talk about about the origin story of what this okay. weekend is all about. We're really getting the mood going with the Dan Glickis trio here. They're kicking off our morning. They've kind of created a theme song uh, for this weekend. We're going to talk with them a little bit later. But Sal, I want to talk to you kind of about what this weekend is all about. We know it's about celebrating artists, the community, getting everybody together. But the origin story yeah. of how you brought this together is kind of amazing. It started at a salon right here, uh, kind of in the heart of this neighborhood. Um, and two women, like-minded women, who wanted to celebrate art. So tell me about yeah. that story. Uh, yeah, so, uh, you know, my, I was at the hairdresser and um, she said, you have to meet this client of mine. Uh, you guys talk about all the same things. And uh, we got together and decided that day to start the Beverly Art Walk. And it has just exploded. Uh, all the, you know, many of the people that are very dear to me, I have met through this experience of organizing this art walk over the years, as well as many other um, art and events, um, you know, throughout the year. So we just, we have a lot of fun. And the art walk is really uh, an expression of all the great stuff that we do and, and have in the neighborhood. And there's 150 artists uh, who will be, uh, you know, yeah. kind of showing off what they're all about this weekend. Yeah. One of the pieces we want to talk about really quickly is this. It's called Quantum Me. What's that piece? So that is a uh, public art sculpture that uh, we brought to the community in 2017. Um, and it was through a grant with the Department of Cultural Affairs Special Events. The artist's name is Davis McCarty. And um, again, it's just an example of the community coming together. We formed a committee. We all got together and reviewed a bunch of different artists. And um, this is what we what we uh, came up with. Amazing. So, There's so much yeah. to talk about. We're going to check in with you throughout the morning. But again, come tomorrow. Check it out. It's a free event for the community. Starts at noon to 4. Is that correct? It, it's noon to 5. Noon to 5. On Saturday. On Saturday. Yeah. All right. Well, yeah. so much more here from the Art Walk. For now, we'll send it back yeah. to you guys in the studio. Looking forward to it, Marissa. Thanks so much. Well, we are jump-starting your Friday morning with a preview of the 11th Annual Beverly Art Walk. Yeah, it's happening tomorrow in the Beverly neighborhood on the south side. Where's Pearlman joining us live with a look at what you can see and also do at the event. Marissa, hello. Hey guys, so good to be with you. Yeah, it is everything Art Walk here in Beverly this morning. We've been speaking with uh, some of the founders, the musicians, and the community members who have made this whole thing come together. Um, and now we're going to introduce you to one of the 150 artists who will be featured uh, here this Saturday. You said 12 to 5. Um, I want to bring in Phil Cotton now. Uh, so often we get to talk about the art, but so rarely we get to speak with the brains behind it, with the artists. So thank you for being with us. Thank you for so, having me. And we're here in um, the Two Mile Coffee Bar, again, one of the 40 venues that is featured here being a, a part of this event this weekend. Mm -hmm. And uh, your art is all around us here this morning. How does that feel to see it all come together? It feels pretty neat, yeah. actually, just to see it. It's sort of like letting your children walk around and make sure they're okay. Absolutely. And, and I want to specifically talk about one of these pieces here, one of your pieces. Talk mm -hmm. to me about this piece that we're seeing in front of it's, it's First of all, it's huge. It's beautiful. Thank um, you. And, and talk to me about how this came to be. Well, this is called The Traveler. And what it illustrates is how we take from our past, bring it to our present, and then take that to our future. So there are three different modes of operation here. And it's based on discovery and how we think about ourselves and how we project those images of ourselves to other people and how we embellish those images of ourselves. So this is a, an exploratory piece about how we develop our own personalities. Incredible. It's absolutely beautiful. Again, just one Thank of the you. many pieces of Phil's here uh, at Two Mile Coffee Bar. Come check out Phil, 150 other artists uh, from the Beverly, mm -hmm. uh, Morgan Park neighborhoods, really all of the Chicago area. Again, it's here. Uh, you can plan out your tour tomorrow from noon to five.
for now. We'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, Marissa, thanks so much. 150 artists. That's